Hello, World Dwellers. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is... Kill, kill, kill. Not really. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna try and complete up Novaria. No, 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 Novaria. One thing that I'm thinking of doing is I'm first gonna go all the way over here. Pick up this doctor's quest, complete it, because I believe if I go and pick a fight with the guards before I do this, I can no longer Marshall, complete this quest. I've had a long day. Don't piss me off. Motherfucker. Yes, I'm sorry. I haven't had much sleep lately. What happened to these people? They're suffering from a toxin. There was an accident. I have a non-disclosure agreement. I shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company. Suit yourself. <laughs> oh. I'm just trying to avoid an incident. What happened to these people? They're suffering from a toxin. I have a non-disclosure agreement. I shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company. Yeah, I actually want the quest. So come on. To because I might be able to help. I'd like to think that the company finds our lives more valuable than their secrets. You know Mira, the VI for Peak 15. She handles the safety protocols for our experiments here. Sounds like she a dangerous thingy. All progress requires. Look, is this really the time for an ethics debate? <laughs> the connection to Mira in the middle of an experiment and the quarantine failed. These three were exposed to a toxin, something we were working on. I need full cooperation if I'm going to help. Do you want these people to live? If not, I'll walk out of here. <laughs> no, wait. It's a bioweapon. <gasps> on an exotic life form discovered on the frontier. They wanted Bitch. something that killed the creature. But there was no profit in something that kills one species on the frontier we kept working on it and adapted it to affect more species forest b is highly infectious but can't pass from one person to another like a bio war attack without a pandemic spread do you imagine that distinction makes this ethical militaries governments there is actually kind, kind of a of big distinction between those two trying to limit the damage still fucking terrible though it. There's a reason the Citadel Conventions forbid bioweapons, Doctor. I didn't expect you'd understand. Our notes and equipment are locked in the quarantine labs. Captain Ventrolis doesn't want to risk more contamination. I'll talk to him. Maybe I can convince him to let me try. I can't ask you to do this officially, but if you can do anything, I'd appreciate it. Talk to you later. Goodbye. I hope you can do something. <gasps> oh, damn. I hope this isn't going to be a Paragon thingy. Maybe I can stuff up the the cure or like extort him or something then i'd be okay with it come 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 don't ask me i don't i don't even know excuse me something you need I've heard about the problems in the quarantine lab. I'd like heard to about the problems with your face. God, I wish we could help those guys. I really do, but we can't risk contamination now. If we survive, your employers will want a report from me. I wonder how much insurance they have on those scientists. All right, you want to gamble with your life? You're not under my command. <laughs> let you in. <laughs> lock the door behind you. He'll run a full scan before I'll let you out. If there are any anomalies, you stay in there. Great. We'll be stuck unless he decides we're healthy. I'll radio ahead not mentally I'll healthy, because that's definitely not. I've got work to do. Bitch. All right, we are not gonna go and do that. We're first going this way. Um. Uh, uh, ooh, let's get, let's get some gear first. I doubt it'll be anything useful, but you never know. I actually didn't think I was making that. Oh, bullshit. Whatever. I'm a hair of lots of Omni Jail. 
It's not like it's in short supply. It kind of annoy me that that happened. Just in case we have any glitches. Glitches? Hello, Han Ola. You're not part of the crew. Call me Shepard. I'm a Spectre sent by the Citadel. There aren't any human Spectre. Ah, shut your face. Look, Plague doesn't care who you are. This lab is under quarantine. Yeah. What do you want? I have Ventralis's permission to go in there. Yeah, he radioed. He also said you have to prove you're not contaminated to get out. You got a death wish? should stand watches on the barricade. <sighs> oh, there's there's stuff here. Let's see. There we go. I didn't panic. I never panic. Yeah, I'll make the cure now. I just want to see if there's any cool things. <coughs> Excuse me. No, I have everything I need now to make that cure. Your mission ends here. Oh, that was... That was pretty easy. I thought she seemed odd. She's surrounded by Geth and pointing a gun at a shooter. <laughs> You're not as stupid as you look. Weapons free. That was actually relatively easy. New armor. Please be better than what I have. Uh, a little better. Yeah, transfer the upgrades. And still the best shield battery I can get. I kind of expected that fight to last longer. That's what she said. They came out of there. That door's locked. How can I get in? A team lead would have access. Like Dr. Cohen. He's in the medical bay. <laughs> I'll be leaving now. Uh, thank you, Han Ola. Yeah. <sighs> I keep forgetting you cannot save in an elevator. Do a pile of keys for recording while I'm sick. But I know, I know you got to have your fix. I'm not looking forward to the decision I have to make in this episode. Definitely not something I want to do. in the lab you sent me to if you set me up uh, you were attacked I, I i don't know anything about that i hate conflict i've never even fired anyone i have my receptionist do it look the guards they've been more on edge since you got here i think they were expecting you and there are more labs in the back the guards won't even let me back there just people with clearance 
Somebody in here needs a punch in the throat. I don't want to get involved in this. I'm just trying to save my friends. Glad How noble. File. An extension on Phelps' work? I thought he was on the right track. I can't thank you enough. That, oh, oh, God, what a cliche. You saved their lives, do you know that? And I almost lost mine. Thanks is all I get. We need to be at peak to fight those aliens. Give us some metagel. Of course, here. You didn't get these from me. Ventralis wanted them saved for his people. I need to administer this. Thanks again. No! Ah. I did not want that. Uh, this sucks. At least I get to kill everyone else here. Uh, I should have guessed saving people's lives is Paragon. Let's just go and piss off these guys. I don't really believe it's pissing them off. Wow. I almost want to undo that. All except the part. I, I just don't want to have handed in the quest. I don't mind having done like the lab and that sort of stuff because that's XP right there. Time to kill some Ragnar. Before I talk to him, I'm just going to take a two-second break. Let's speak to Tarkovsky. Tartovsky. Tar... Tartakovsky. Wow. I'm here to secure the situation. If by secure you mean shoot every monster I see, sure. I'm serious. I am certain you are having strong feelings. But what has happened here, it is our fault. You understand? No, what are you saying that I must kill you rather than, than them? I understand that we'll be dead soon. Talk fast. Binary Helix found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Ragnar's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. They should have destroyed it. Why hatch it? <coughs> Helix planned to clone Ragnai, mass produce them, create an army. But when they get here, they find this egg is not a common Ragnai. It is a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to Rift Station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. We'll kill them all. We'll take care of her later. No, listen. The Ragnai are intelligent species. They achieve star travel. They are not animals. I am thinking that without a queen, Ragnai do not develop properly. Her mind is shaping theirs. These Ragnai are uncontrollable. So what? Are you telling me I shouldn't kill these things? I want to kill everything. Uh, actually, I was to tell you the opposite. Stop talking in circles then, men. Ragnai are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but... They must be euthanized. I am thinking that the neutron purge must be set off. How do we set off the purge? Army the purge. All you do is Once a year, you can kill as many Rachni as you want, and there will be no consequences. Today is that year. Day of the year. Today is the day of the year where you can do it. Oh, I killed your face! Wait, I need a code. A secret code.
Now are we going to kill all the aliens? I have full access to the activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Code You'd think I would be asking if I didn't have the code. Zero zero seven nine code Omega local execution. Jeez. Yes, come closer to me. All the better to shoot you with, my dear. Well, wow, that is really, really loud. Oh well. All's well that ends well. Oh, you can't save because it's a timed area. Everyone okay? That worked out a lot better than I expected. All the Rachni are dead, and now we're gonna go back to the top, and then they're gonna be like, Oh, you killed all the Rachni, thank you so much. We love you so much. They are not going to try and kill me. No siree. Ah, uh, I've had this bug before and so now I, that is actually why I've been saving it so much. Because for some reason the elevators are glitching. Which means the door doesn't close so I don't actually go anywhere. Let's see. Yes, it worked those time. At least didn't have to do that seven times. What? No one at the guard station and they even fixed the grate? This isn't suspicious. They're just cleaning up their act. This is completely normal. Completely normal indeed. I'm sorry about this ship. <sighs> We've got orders from Venezia. Open fire! You must die. What the fuck? Yes, that's that. Uh, go stand there then, instead of out in the open. I don't know why I have to teach you how to do this. I can use any gun to kill you. No, uh, you got that the wrong way around, sister. I'm the one who killed you. Let's go see the doctor. Hello, doctor. Wow, he cleared out fast. And all the merchants and stuff. So they must have, like, been told. Go hide away. We're expecting trouble, see? Well, back door is way easier than this. Shit. Wowzers. And there's more. Oh 
shotguns are badass. And kind of weird. Take him down. You must die. Ha ha. Crushed your face. I love shooting the boxes onto them. They so foolish. They so silly. Oh shit. Um. There we go. Problem solved. Headshot. Uh, elevator time. Yeah. Always be wary of elevators. They are dangerous, son. I'm changing the shotgun now. It's so powerful. <laughs> but I do see its range is going to be a bit of an issue. But I'm just shooting up everything. Incendiary rounds. Wow, I just got all the stuff. Hmm, glass is empty. Um, I'm gonna take armor piercing off. We're gonna do that. No. Heat sink two. We're instead gonna up our damage. I'm only going to be able to fire off two rounds. If I fire off a second round immediately after the first, it is going to cause a bit of a heating issue. What? That's so weird. Boop, boop. I wonder what... Oh, because there's an enemy on the board. Then let's go kill that enemy. Exactly the problem I was worried about. But it did do a shit ton of damage. <sighs> Quick save complete. Let's go meet Benezia, people. You do not know the privilege of being or almost knocked over my glass. Power in creation. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. Her children were to be ours, raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. Wow. So you basically wanted I to make slaves? By sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. I have no idea what you're talking about, and I don't care. Indeed. What have you told her about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? <laughs> She's like, jeez, what am I going to do? You faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. You won't look so smug with a hole in your head. Your insolence is a poor mask for your fear. And your face is a poor mask for your face. That's a pretty powerful ability, though. Two shots. That was not what I was expecting to happen, but that rocket just came at the completely wrong time. It's okay, it's okay. We expect this sort of shit to happen. I just didn't expect that quite like that. And now my initial encounter is going to be nowhere near as effective. You do. I won't be moved. Indeed. What could I say? 
super quick. Now let's do this. Can't get a clear shot on her. What the fuck? Oh, they shot that thing. Shit. I'm okay with that. I'm not afraid. Wow. Shit, there's a lot of explodey things around here. At that range, you take out a sniper in one shot? Why have I not been using shotguns all these years? Okay, Liara didn't make it here, but... Oh, Matriarch Venezia shoots at you as well. Um, I can try and counter snipe them. Just wait for it. Wait for it. Okay, there has to only be like one left. Still on the gates. This is not over. This is actually going okay. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. I expected better from Asari commandos. Yeah, that was kind of the Geth were more of a problem than the commandos. You will. You will die. You must listen. Saren still Wait, what? This is a completely unexpected twist. Briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. How can he compel you? He's not even here. People are not themselves around Saren. You come to idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. The ship that attacked Eden Prime? I didn't think anything that size could land on a planet. It has a very powerful mass effect drive, but that is not Sovereign's true power. The longer you stay aboard, the more Saren's will seems correct. <coughs> at his feet and smile as his words pour into you. Like poison. It is subtle at first. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, eager to serve. You're such a tool. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. Tell me where the Mew Gate is before I lose my temper. Of course, Commander. Oh, she's being so docile. Take it, please. 
Uh, okay. Knowing the relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destiny. It's because he didn't know yet. He but was still going to go find out. Quickly. I transmitted the coordinates Thus, Theros. before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You should. You should. Oh, you should. Mother, I don't leave. Fight him. You've always made me proud, Liara. Die. Die. I smell trouble. Oh no, shit. The game didn't even know what to do with that. Oh, this is not over. Uh, I expected better from a sorry. How can the key? That's actually least not so bad. No, you have to mother. Let's go this way around this time. Not bad. Ah. See, like, things go so different each time you try it. That time was so much easier. I don't know why. I it just was. We'll have to stop him, Shepherd. First you turn on the council, now on Saren. You're not loyal to anything, are you? So harsh, though. that is how history will moan me. <coughs> Mother, good night, Wayne. I will see you again with the dawn. My life. They always said there would be a. Uh, the light comes after you die, not while you die, jeez. Q. One more conversation, and then we can get the fuck out of here. GTFO. That that walk is just creepy. Little foot dragon. This one serves as our voice. Don't care if you're gonna die. We cannot sing. You will never sing again. Not in these low spaces. Low spaces like a grave. Your musics are. Colorless. We filled you with enough plasma to pop a tank. <laughs> this vessel is at the edge. Yet she struggles. You cannot see her magnificence. We are breathing on the embers. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silence. We are Rachni. I didn't come here to talk to bugs. Oh, you burn. Are not in harmony with those who hoped to control us. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we 
to fade away once more. Yep. Look, those tanks, acid, <coughs> strong enough to kill anything, no matter its biology. They wouldn't have installed that if they weren't afraid of the consequences of her getting loose. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us, or return our people to the silence of memory. Make your peace with the galaxy. The Rachni are a dead race. No, stop feeling and think. Even if you disagree with Asari morals, you must see she could be an ally. Is our kind so frightening? You would seek our silence if you cannot muffle our songs? If you cannot have us as your obedient claws? This time stay dead. We will not embrace the great silence. Not happy about having to do that. I know I had to, but it just it feels wrong. Paragon for life. It actually physically hurt me making that decision. What? There we go. Made it. I'm still upset about this decision I had to make. Oh, poop. Shit. So close. Also, we have to do that. But as far as I know, I'm just gonna hit myself a tram and then that is the part. I did not enjoy having to do that. I've never killed the Rachni Queen before, and... <sighs> I can't actually see that as being a right decision, ever. I saw it from both, like, hey, they could be helpful later on kind of point of view, and also the the whole species that's come back from the dead and I just I just murdered them look there's still some Rachna out in the galaxy so I don't know what's going to happen there because there's a couple missions in this game still where there's Rachna out there on st like derelict moons and that sort of stuff. There's a, a ripoff on s of Starship Troopers. Next, Commander. Head for the Mew Relay. The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. The Commander is right. We cannot rush off blind. We still need to learn more about Saren. Who put you in charge? Did the Commander resign when I wasn't looking? I won't be a puppet for the Asari. I give the orders around here, understood? Forgive me, Commander. I was only trying to help. We're done here. Crew dismissed. Wow. Area so to wake, cold. Want me to patch you through to the council? Nope. Don't bother. Aye, aye, ma'am. But that is all from me today. Commander Shepard signing out. Keep it real. So remember. Please give me a thumbs up if you liked it, thumbs down if you didn't, and if you can, why don't you hit subscribe now.